So this week we are talking about our favorite TV shows growing up. And I have grouped mine into animated and live action. There are tons of fantastic and also obscure animated shows uh, from the 90s. So I can agree with you on a lot of your points, Josh. I ought to enjoy the Animaniacs and shows on Nickelodeon. Uh, there were lots to choose from and I enjoyed a great many of them. I also like Tiny Toons and Animaniacs, so those two kind of were up there in that same kind of category. Um, but probably one of my most favorite, if not my most favorite animated uh, series was Muppet Babies. Is anyone surprised? You shouldn't be. It has Star Wars and Indiana Jones. And really, yes, nerdy. Okay, so even then, there were signs. Next would probably be Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Watch that religiously. Love that show. Um, had action figures and everything. Michelangelo is the best. Also liked Rugrats. Also a fantastic show. Like Animaniacs. There's a lot of things in there that kids aren't going to get, uh, but that adults would. Uh, DuckTales, Chippendale. Um, also, I watch those a lot. Another show that I watch a lot that is not animated and is not live action, really, um, are like puppet shows like Fraggle Rock, stuff like that. Watch the crap out of those. As far as live action, there were tons of live action shows that I watched as a kid. Um, probably my most favorite show ever was on PBS, Ghost Rider. <sighs> Loved that show. The best show <laughs> ever, I think. Oh, it was so good. I loved it. I was so sad when they stopped making it. Oh, so good. Um, some other ones. Uh, Bill Nye. Also, again, the nerd is just oozes out of me. Uh, Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Where in the World is Carmen Sandiego? You know, the game show. Also on PBS. Uh, I didn't have cable at this point, so I watched a lot of shows on PBS. Uh, so, those are some of my most favorite live-action shows. Um, I also watch things like Blossom, and like I said, It's All That, and some of the comedy shows on Nickelodeon. also watched Are You Afraid of the Dark uh, as a scary show. I still watch scary shows, despite the fact that I was petrified of the dark and ghosts. I religiously watched Unsolved Mysteries, which, if you don't know... Almost always is about ghosts. Or a lot of times. There were a lot of ghosty type innuendos on that show. So, uh, yeah, I was a weird kid. I was like a glutton for punishment. So I would watch Unsolved Mysteries. I would be freaked out. And then I would have to walk to my room in the dark. Why did I do this to myself? I, to this day, I still don't know. But I did watch that show religiously. I also watched Rescue 911. Um, I liked that show. It was like Cops, but not. It was better than Cops, because Cops is all just about sleazy, skanky criminals. Rescue 911 was nice. A little uplifting sometimes. I watched a lot of TV growing up, but those definitely really stick out in my mind. I have a lot of awesome memories of them. I will talk to you guys next week. John, I'll see you tomorrow. Update uh, for the wedding. We're changing caterers, I think. Uh, haven't decided on the cake for sure. But cranes. Cranes. I have 800 cranes now. Uh, I'm, I probably actually have 900 cranes. I, I think if I'm not 900, I'm very close to 900. Um... And I should be able to finish uh, the rest of them tonight or tomorrow. So my deadline of March, I'm actually going to meet it mostly, which is awesome! Dress ships this week, in case you didn't know. And that's really all the updates I have.